Hi. If you are listening to this, my name is Kylie. Welcome collection family, remember no spamming, no cursing and please no sus comments. Remember to hit the like button, and subscribe if you are new, Corvette Corvette. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the stream. My bad. I had to like, I had to fix a couple of stuff on my the on my freaking on my freaking chat because I wanted to change it. What up, chat? What up? What up? What up? Good morning, everybody. Hold on, let me fix this real quick so I can see everyone's beautiful names on the stream. What up? Yeah, that's better. I like that better. I think I like that better. Should I put it right here? There it goes. What up, chat? Good morning. Shout out to everyone pulling up. My bad. I was like, uh, I was literally fixing something real quick. What up, chat? What is Gucci? Mike check, Mike check. What up? Shout out to Kayla Owen, Rahus, Britain Spears, Jerry. What up? Antonio, you're out. What up, man? Uh, Andrew, uh, Owen in the building, Rahus. Shout out to all my mods. Nick L in the building. What up, bro? Hawan. What up, man? Ty, Andrew, Laura. Uh, is it Laura? Laura? What up, man? What up? Derek in the building. What up, bro? Nod 2007, what up, bro? Kuro says, uh, what up, Rafi? What up, man? Took a W this morning on Europe? Dude, there's a lot of stock in this Jordan 1. Welcome back, guys. We have another live cop here at Rafi Collects for the Jordan 1 Bordeaux. Uh, what up, John Louis? Albert, what up, Romisha in the building? D Sneaker Tech, what up, man? Papa Smoke, what up, bro? Trey Mac. Reviving, what up, man? Sergio Deleon in the building. What up, Deleon? Stock is 70,000. Yes, we did see that, man. 70 freaking thousand pairs, man. How do you guys feel about man? Like, I was watching, it was funny because, like, I was watching, um, I was watching JMK's video, and like, are we tired? Are we tired of Jordan 1s yet, man? Sheesh. But it's nice because we haven't... When was the last Jordan 1 we've seen before this? I mean, on a Saturday, you know what I mean? So we haven't... I haven't really streamed on a Saturday in the last two weeks. I'm not going to lie to you guys, man. Saturdays is always the low-key... Like, the low-key, like, streams. Because, like, people are, like, recovering from Friday and the whole entire week of, you know, you know, releases and work and stuff like that. So Saturdays is more like, you know, sleep in day because no one is like waking up early for work. So everyone has the day off. So it's like everyone's sleeping in right now, man. No, normally Saturdays is not too crazy. So um, we'll see how today goes. All right. Um, I know there was like, you know, small little things that were getting, you know, kind of put around But when it comes to rumors about the Alma Maneers, but I don't honestly don't think it's gonna happen uh, Meaning like a shock drop or something like that because they're already loaded up in the you know loaded up as a scheduled release for December 3rd um, So I don't think that's gonna happen at all in my personal opinion. So if you guys are hearing that rumor, I mean if it happens, I <sighs> I, dude, that'd be crazy, but I doubt it will. John Louis starting off it, ah, with a $5 donation. What up, Kabigan? Como esta? Good morning to you, John Louis. Thank you so much for the $5 donation. Starting it off hot, man. Thank you so much, bro. I appreciate you. Hope everything is well, man. 
um yes for anyone that's gonna ask me about the cool gray 11s they did ship out my pair finally i finally got a notification from the sneakers app and it was like i know there was like some people like oh there's they're canceling pairs and this and that i was like bro you got to understand there was ninety-eight thousand pairs that got released bro Ninety-eight thousand. so they were like literally shipping out these cool gray 11s by like groups they were like divided in groups right so i mean ninety-eight thousand pairs is a lot to handle so i wasn't surprised that there was a some sort of delay with the cool gray 11 so nothing is getting canceled i haven't heard anyone's order getting canceled no nothing it was just super delayed so if you're one of those people that are still waiting for your cool gray 11s just stay patient okay what my suggestion is is if you're still waiting for a label download the fedex app all right sometimes if uh something's gonna get sent to you from fedex if you download the fedex app and create an account it will have a label on the back end popped up on the fedex app if not um then you just gotta wait you know what i'm saying you just gotta stay patient a lot of pairs out there getting shipped out mine literally got shipped out yesterday bro yesterday so i'm not surprised it's supposed to arrive like monday or sunday i think that's what it said but i mean eventually it'll get here but what really got here all right i'm gonna let you guys know i did get a package in yesterday all right if uh some of you guys uh hit you guys know what this box is you guys know what this box is boy we got this bad boy in should we unbox this on the stream today or what or should we wait for a video um i didn't think this was gonna show i thought i honestly thought it was gonna show up yet uh today not yesterday but it showed up on my doorstep and i had to sign for it so super heavy shoe um so we could unbox that on the stream if you guys would like unless you guys want to wait till i post a video because i was actually planning on uh posting a video of it so if you guys want to unbox that we could do that later today um so a lot of you guys saying unbox unbox open it yeah man i'm excited bro i haven't seen them in hand yet um so this might be uh this might be a really good one please do not spam the chat please don't spam please do not spam yeah we'll we'll unbox it a little bit later though but i was actually planning on i wanted to do a video for you guys so i could get some content out there uh but we'll we'll, we'll see what happens though uh sell me your hat part now this hat's not going anywhere bro this is like literally one of my favorite hats in my collection bro like one of my favorite hats in my uh hat collection like for real for real one of my favorite hats uh there's also some new balances dropping this morning i'm not sure if anyone's going for new balances the concepts i'm gonna pass on the new balances this morning uh, i'm not a big fan of the colorway um i'm not sure if i'm a fan of the the model but that's just me my alpha white twos and uh twos and cool grays came in yesterday i'm excited to un -DS them there you go lucky kicks congratulations on both w's bro both w's uh make sneaker review raf like uh them videos yeah that's what i was planning on to like posting a video on sunday for you guys doing the unboxing on feet give you guys my honest opinions about the shoe but it's actually fun to actually do you know you know an unboxing on stream because it's a little bit more exciting so we might we might actually make a make a video and then maybe unbox it later today i don't know so what do you think about today's drop um, so today's drop for the Jordan 1s, there's 70,000 pairs, man. Are you guys copping or are you guys skipping on this, man? You guys let me know. And I don't even know if this is a 10-minute draw. Let me double check on the sneakers app. I'm not sure. I don't know. Is this a pass or a cop chat? I don't know if I want to grab this shoe, honestly. I've already told you guys, like, I'm honestly picking and choosing a lot of my sneakers. So I'm not sure if I need this shoe. I don't know. Hold on. I don't know why the hell my freaking app is not loading up. Uh, I won the raffle. Okay. Uh, just here for support shots. Britney Spears. I appreciate it. Pass. Pass. Yeah, it's a, it's gonna be a 10 minute draw. 10 minute draw this morning. Cop. Already copped. 
Yeah, I seen a lot of you guys copped um, in store. And I seen a lot of you guys cop the freaking sneakers pass. Sneakers pass was yesterday. So I told you guys about that. That, you know, heads up. That normally goes live around 10 a.m. Uh, what up, Brian? What up, bro? Yo, Raph, uh, appreciate you putting me uh, with the uh, street market supply gear. Definitely grab that uh, yay vintage. There you go. Raus, I'm excited for you to grab me, man. Let me know how you like them in hand. Um... Popped on stock X, take a pair for the wifey. I asked the wifey if she wanted the shoe. She was like, eh. So I don't know. But I don't realize that she doesn't know if it's maroon. So because like she was all like, how about those uh how about those ones that are releasing next week? And she was talking about the Alma Maneers. So we might try to grab some Alma Maneers for the wifey and I. So we'll see what happens though. But she she wasn't a big fan of this one. So I don't know. Grab these, but if you can't get the Alma Manier ones, get rid of them. Yeah, these are definitely gonna. I think these ones are gonna tank to 220, bro. This uh, this Jordan one is gonna be a, like a 200, 220. So, uh, need week uh, a must cop, and I'm um, manifesting that W next week. I'm telling you all, bro. Next week is gonna be a crazy week, bro. Alma Manier is gonna be the craziest drop of the week, cause. Alma Manier is dropping on their website, I believe, on the 24th. And on the 24th, that's literally the next drop for uh, upcoming on the 24th. Next week is freaking Thanksgiving. So next week, Wednesday, a day before Thanksgiving. Um, that's the Alma Manier drop. So you guys already know that's going to be really crazy. We have the nines dropping. We have some dunks dropping. We also have the potas dropping, bro. Like, that's going to be a crazy freaking stream, bro crazy stream save your save your bread bro save your money black friday is next week cyber monday is the following monday so it's gonna be a pretty solid week i would say going towards the end of november november is looking real real hot when it comes to end the end of it but coming into december starting it off man <sighs> i'm a Meniers, jordan 11s woman's air force ones Tuarvaski, whatever how you want to say these. These are absolutely trash. I'll probably skip on these. Retail price is way too much for me. Way too much. Um, and I seen a lot of you guys hit on Ama Maneers, bro. Ama Maneers Insta raffles. I feel like I've seen millions, not millions, hundreds of people hitting on the Ama Maneer Insta raffle. Did anyone in here hit? I mean, I need, I seen stretch kicks hit. So, I mean, there's a lot of people. I mean, I'm saying a lot of people hit on the Alma Manier in-store raffle. So, you guys let me know, bro. You guys let me know. Because that was... That was crazy. I was actually... I woke up and a lot of you guys sent me messages. Yo, Rafi, I hit, I hit, I hit, I hit on the Alma Manier's in-store raffle. So that was that's awesome. I, and the thing is, like, this is the reason why I salute Alma Manier. And from from the amount of W's that we were seeing in store, like, I'm so excited for how the website's gonna go, bro. Like, I feel like Alma Manier is gonna come down to one of the best releases of 2021, bro. That has to be hands down. Alma Manier is gonna come down to the best release for a manual user for the year 2021, hands down. Unless they literally, you know, fuck it up and they mess up this entire release next week, Wednesday. Like, that's the only way, bro. So, probably the best manual users to hit on a shoe when it comes to any collaboration this year. What up, New York dad in the building? What up, bro? Good morning to you. So... The amount of W's that we are we are seeing on the install raffles, that's what makes everyone is really that's what make what that's what everyone's like excited for. That's the reason why. Like if everyone's hitting in store, I can't imagine the amount of people they're gonna hit on the website. So threes is better than the ones. I totally agree. I think the threes are definitely better than the ones. Shouts to the sneaker attic in the bill. What up, bro? I definitely agree with that. Um I feel like the threes are more wearable. What up, Jason? 
What up, Corvette, Corvette? You already know the vibes. Stop saying I'm a Manier. 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 What are you gonna do about it, Rant Tyler? Rant Tyler, what you gonna do? <laughs> Uh, we needed Chicago ones in 2022. 2022, man, I'm feeling like it's gonna be the year of the Jordan twos, bro. They're gonna, they're gonna put out all these Jordan twos, man. Jordan twos is definitely going to be the year for for the twos to come out. They're bringing back the twos. Um, they're going, they're already going crazy on eBay already. We'll see, man. I've seen the materials on the Jordan on the Alma Alma Meniers, like. It looks good. It looks good. And I'm excited for it. And I'm excited for anyone that's going to pick up a pair. So, I, we don't even have a pair, uh, a store on the West Coast. I think it's all East Coast for the store. Raffy, bro, I need the I need the wake up song, man. You guys need the wake up song? We need to wake up, bro. It's Saturday, bro. All right? Everyone needs to wake up. All right? Your boy only slept for two short hours i need everyone to wake up all right i understand you guys partied a little too hard on friday night i know we, we're exhausted from taking all those w's in the last week but hey you guys need to wake up bro and get excited for next week it's thanksgiving the the week of thank to being thankful for uh you know being alive and eating well and we have a we have crazy drops next week. So you guys need to wake the hell up. Alright? Wake up. Alright. Y'all wanna you don't make me play the song. Yo, smash that like button. Let's get to 100 likes real quick, chat. Alright. Watch a while on the highway. Wake me up. Delion, please drive safe, man. Please just please drive safe. Where are the Yeezys at? What do you mean Yeezys? What Yeezys talking about? He said, I need to wake up. I just got off my 12 hour shift and I got to come back later. Oh no. I do need some water though. I do need some water, bro. I'm feeling real dry. Hold on. Let me be, I'll be right back chat. So I entertain my chat. I'm gonna grab some water. All right, I got some water. Hey, if we could get a hundred likes real quick, let's go ahead and unbox the shoe, bro. If we could get a hundred likes real quick, I'll go ahead and unbox the off whites. All right, I'll go ahead and unbox it. But you guys gotta run it up, bro. You guys gotta run it up. Who's getting the Pharrells? Pfft, trash, bro. Ain't, I, I me personally, I'm skipping on the Pharrells. That's just that's just me, man. I'm skipping on the Pharrells this morning. Anyone know if the New Balances are a raffle or a Leo today? I'm not sure. It might be a Leo. It might be a Leo. All right. Make sure you guys run it up real quick, chat. I need everyone to represent this the the collection fam real quick. Appreciate you guys coming through. All right. We we gotta wake up, man. Everyone's asleep. We gotta wake everybody up, bro. For real, for real. We gotta wake everyone up. I, th I think that's a pretty good plan, man. It's time to wake up, bro. Time to get out of bed. Time to wake up Gotta get out of
you're making excuses for your shit. When you're making excuses, time to wake up, baby, Jack. You just need to learn. It's time to wake up, bro. You got a heart. If you're not entertained, I don't know what to tell you, bruh. Time to wake up, chat. All right? Woo! Man, I'm feeling good after that. I'm feeling real good after that, bro. Woo! Oh, man. I think I feel real good. I just, I just, I think I just broke a sweat. I think I just broke a sweat. Whew. Ah. Yeah. There we go. Whew. Ah. Ugh. All right, we good. Are we ready for this unboxing or what, chat? Are we ready or what? Woo! Got a couple reps in, feeling real good. All right, I think we're ready for an unboxing, man. I'm really excited for this one right here. Um, once again. Shout outs to Off-White, okay? Probably one of the best, probably the best hit. Probably the best hit of 2021 goes to the Off-White right here and the collection fam. Today is a special day, chat. If I can know how to unbox a shoe. Here we go. How the hell... Oh, here we go. Here it goes. Woo! Receipt. Wow, this is some good quality paper, eh? Oh my goodness, look at this packaging, bro. Wow. <laughs> Yo, the, this box is insane. Look at this. Sheesh. Wow. There's your label. Wow, bro. This was probably the, the, this is the best cop of this year, bro. Here we go, man. That, this box is sturdy, man. This is, it's a heavy, it's a heavy box. They're individually wrapped, bro. No well. They're individually wrapped. Okay, let's, let's set. Let's set this aside real quick, chat. Hold on. They're individually wrapped. <laughs> it comes in its own Ziploc bag. Hey, yo. When do we ever see this type of packaging? It comes with its its own Ziploc bag, bro. That is crazy. Look at that. And here we have it, chat.
Here we freaking have it. We have the Air Jordan 2 Lows. Off whites. Wow. I feel like a kid in the candy store, bro. Comes with two extra laces. Red. Doesn't even look. Is that red? Red and off white. Let's take the other one out. Individually wrapped. That is crazy, bro. The shoe is pretty heavy. I ain't gonna lie to you guys. The shoe is pretty freaking heavy. That is nuts how this is individually wrapped, bro. That's crazy. Here we have it, man. You got that zip tie. We have the iconic Michael Jordan signature on the side of the sneaker. Wow, this shoe is insane, man. Woo! Yeah, that shoe's fire, man. The fact that it's the Chicago colorway just makes it even better. Like, I skipped on the black pair. I didn't even go for the black pair. I just wanted this pair right here. Like, look at... Like, that is interesting, bro. I really how I really like how it's like... It's like translucent right here, kind of. And it kind of looks like it's breaking down. Like, if it was aged. Has that, like, aged look on the midsole. Man, these are fire, bro. I don't know how anyone skipped on the release. Like, this shoe is sturdy. The leather is okay. The leather is just like, it's like really, really, really thick leather, I would say. And, and you know, normal, normally on your a lot of the Jordan 2s. But the tongue feels good. It just feels like a really, really good quality sneaker, man. A really, really good. Should we put it on? Should we undies them or what? I wouldn't say this is top five sneakers of the year. Wouldn't put this in my top five um, at all. I would definitely put this top, maybe top 10, but this has to be the best. Wow. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hold on. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna put these, these bad boys on, man. I think the cream laces would look fire on with these, bro. Yeah, that's fire. I don't know if you guys can see that. Yeah, that's fire. Man, this is a really, really like sturdy shoe, I would say. A heavy shoe. Fire, bro. I went true to size. I went true to size with this shoe. Yeah. Super dope, man. Glad that I could hit it for retail. Um, This is actually my second pair of Jordan 2s in my collection. It's not my, it's not my first. I have a pair of 2s in my collection. But they, they pretty heavy. Yes. Shout out to Torn. They are pretty heavy. They are pretty heavy. Um, I wouldn't say I wouldn't say top five, bro. This is definitely not top top five worthy. Definitely wouldn't say top five worthy, but this has to be probably one of the best hits we hit manually, man. This has to be one of the best manual hits we hit this year, bro. This has to. So, super fire, still DS. Nah, I mean we could try to make we can make a DS. That's all you gotta do right there, DS. <laughs> but no, man, I the detailing on this sneaker is insane. But I don't know why it's so freaking heavy, man. The shoe is freaking heavy for a low top sneaker, Jordan. Like it's it's pretty heavy. I would definitely say this is pretty heavy, but it's a very sturdy shoe for sure. I would say like this would be like a collector's item. Um 
definitely a collector's item just because it has the Michael Jordan uh Michael Jordan signature on the side right here so if you actually hit I think this is a really good collector's item for sure because it's a Chicago colorway it's off-white it just gives you it just gives you a really like good like it, I don't know man I really like the midsole right here because it just gives you that cream off-white look uh looks like it aged a bit where it's cracking I really like the detailing that they add right there like it's literally translucent like right here feels like and like you could actually like it's like super hard i would thought this would be like some sort of rubber but it's not it's like super solid right there like if you press against it like there it's it's pretty freaking sturdy um but i think if i would wear this i'd probably swap it out with the cream laces i think the cream laces would look really good with this it literally does look like a bowling shoe bro it literally looks like a bowling shoe like dead ass looks like a bowling shoe but i mean overall glad that i hit for retail you really can't complain with this for retail um these go for how much right now like six hundred dollars six hundred dollars i'm actually curious how much these are going for i'm not i'm not selling these at all i'm keeping this for the toe um, because it's definitely like I said, it's a it's definitely a good collector's item to have uh, Let me see how much these are going for last sale was uh, what the hell just happened? Back on StockX Okay, so for a size 8 I went true to size this goes for six hundred and fifty eight dollars, bro they're going for a good amount of money man six hundred and fifty eight dollars and let me tell you guys something i don't think this is gonna go down now at this point like people already have their pairs it, it seems like uh some people are still waiting for the pairs but it looks like man i don't think this is gonna go down i think it's gonna stay where it's at maybe it'll go down a little bit but i don't know i think it's gonna stay I think it's gonna stay where it's at because of the uh, because of the colorway. I think it's because the colorway, the Chicago colorway, and I don't think I, if you if I could recall, like I don't think there's any Michael Jordan signature on any of the off whites. So, and the fact that this is a Chicago colorway, you guys already know, man, it's gonna do some some decent numbers. I got my first sneakers hit two days ago for exclusive access early pair of the Air Jordan 3 patchwork. Ah, Carnage, man. Hey, at least you got exclusive access. That's a that's a plus. So yeah, this is a really clean shoe, man. I'll definitely have a full review for you guys and probably an on-feet look. Um, definitely excited to get a picture with these bad boys. I already have an outfit ready for this for you guys. Uh, I'm definitely excited to put this on and uh, give you guys a fit pick because uh, these ones definitely crazy crazy in hand man crazy in hand is it worth the resale I don't know man honestly I don't think I would I don't think I would pay resale for these honestly I'm not gonna lie to you guys I don't think it's a Jordan 2 unless you're a huge Jordan 2 collector I mean sure why not but me personally, I don't think it's worth paying seven hundred dollars for the shoe unless you are a huge Jordan two and Jordan, uh, uh, you know, Chicago fan, I guess. But me personally, I don't think it's worth seven hundred dollars to pay right now unless you are willing to let let go a couple sneakers in your collection and grab these bad boys. So, um, I'm excited, man. I'm really excited. I. Uh, Got to see these in hand, and you guys witnessed my reaction for this shoe. Super clean shoe, man. Super, super clean. Packaging is A1. Definitely say it comes with individually wrapped. It's crazy, but uh, let me put this real quick back in the box. So, if you guys just now tuning in, we just unboxed the off-white Jordan 2s in the Chicago colorway um yeah super clean bro super super clean 
I don't know. I just got to look at it a little bit because I, I just like how it's distressed right here too. Kind of gives you a little bit more detailing around the sneaker as well as the tongue. The tongue feels good on it too. Pretty soft. This has to include one, two, uh, three. See, one, two, three, four, I think. This is my fourth. No, this is my fifth off-white sneaker in my collection. My fifth off-white. I have the twos. I have the dunks. I have the fives. I have the fours. One, one, two, three, four. What else did I mean? Oh, and I have the MCAs. So that includes the off-whites that I have in my collection. Uh, shout out to JV3. Thank you so much for subscribing. Adventure Squad. Uh, April Batra. Thank you so much for subscribing. I appreciate your guys' support. Uh, I'm not going to wear them, Raffy, bro. These are uh, literally art piece, and I wouldn't uh, love to showcase. I would love to showcase them in that fire box and enjoy looking at them. Me, personally, like I said, I when I buy my sneakers, I like to wear them, but, I mean, definitely a good collector's piece for sure. So, um, I'm in, like, four different draws for these besides uh, the sneakers app, Hope I Hit. Hey, good luck, Wisdom. Rafi, you trying to, uh... Wait, Rafi, you trying to get uh, in a call later? Yeah, Carnage, just hit me up later, bro. Text me, man. Text me on Discord. Hit me up on Discord. We'll talk. We'll talk if you knew, if you want to talk about stuff. Uh, did you uh, put the wake up song already? Yeah, we already turned on the wake up song earlier, about like 10 minutes ago. So that's why I'm like up. So UA Rafi collects. What the hell, bruh? You really at this point? You reaching? Um, what are you picking off off white twos or dawn twos? So, like I said, I don't know, man. I think I'm gonna go with these over the jug. I don't know, bro. This is literally my two off white, uh, not off white. These are only my, the only Jordan twos I have in my collection now. These ones, and I have these. So, I don't know what I would prefer. Honestly, I think I would still go with these ones. I don't know. Maybe I, I still need to keep this in the collection a little longer. But, I don't know. These are my only Jordan 2s in my collection now. So, um, probably going to be my only Jordan 2s in my collection. Elchu, uh, no shot. We have uh, 350 people in here and only 50, uh, 152 likes. Make sure you guys run it up, though. Run it up. Shout out to Romy P. Rappy, do you still have your undefeated Air Force Ones? Uh, blue Croc? Air Force One Blue Croc? What do you mean? My undefeated... Oh, yeah, yeah, I still have them. I still have them. They're up there. They're all the way up there. I have another row that you don't see, like, on the top. I still have all the undefeated dunks in my collection. I, besides the black one. The, the black one I actually sold. Uh, it was actually not my size. Uh, smash that like button. Boy, the man, you already know the vibes. If we get to 200 likes, we appreciate you guys. Ross got a big brother, little sister program going on in his stream right now. What? What up, Josh Peck? Shout out to Josh Peck in the bill. What up, bro? How you doing, man? Good morning to you. What time is it? Yeah, we got 20 more minutes. 20 more minutes, chat. 20 more minutes. You going for the Brooklyn Dunks? I'm um, nah. I am not. Uh, I swear I hate high tops, but I still uh, buy them. There you go. Good luck to everyone this week. I have faith that I will hit on the Ah Mama near Raffi A. Like I said, you got to manifest those W's. Still undecided if I want uh, if I want uh, want these. Really don't care for the silver swoosh, but the colorway is fire. Yeah, if you're talking about today's drop, I mean, if you need a maroon colorway in your sneaker collection, you might as well go for it. In my personal opinion, like I don't have any maroon, but 
I feel like the next maroon shoe, I really want the Alma Manier, bro. I really want the Alma Manier. Uh, stock numbers is going to be 70,000. 70,197 pairs. So there is a good amount of pairs out there, chat. And I feel like if you actually went for it this morning, I feel like you would hit. So I feel like this is definitely going to be one of the sleepers, sleeper colorways of 2021, in my personal opinion. Um, I feel like these ones definitely will hold its value later down the road. Um, if you think about it, this is kind of like the Midnight Navy Blue vibe, right? That released last year, but in a maroon colorway. So, I don't know. It's totally up to you, chat. I feel like this is a must. It's a good cop. If you need a Jordan, if you need a Jordan 1, if you need a Jordan 1 in your sneaker collection, and you need, you need this uh, maroon colorway, I would say yes. Go for it. Raph, you passing on? I, dude, honestly, I'm not decided yet, bro. I'm indecided at this point. I actually might go for it, bro. Just because you really can't go wrong on hitting on a Jordan 1 for retail. Like, you know what I mean? Like, come on, chat. Like, a Jordan 1 for retail and it's a maroon and white colorway? It's not bad. It's not bad of a shoe. I understand. You guys want the Ah Mama Nears. I totally understand. But come on. This is not a bad sneaker right i understand it's not the most limited sneaker but it's actually pretty clean it's not a bad shoe it's not a bad shoe at all i, I would definitely say it's not a bad shoe i feel like the wifey would love this sneaker maybe we should go for the wifey i feel like it's gonna be an easy cop for grade school i'm not sure what the grade school big kids uh um stock numbers are but i'm pretty sure it's as high Go for it and you'll, uh, and if you hit and change your mind, return it. No, I'm not going to do that, bro. I've never actually returned a shoe besides the shoe that freaking Nike forgot to freaking send me. All right. You remember the sandals that we went for? They end up sending me some woman's Pegasus. And I really, I literally let them know. I was like, yo, I'm going to return this shoe, but can you please give me the right sneaker? But they said they were like out of stock. If you guys remember the sandal unboxing that we did on the stream and they they freaking Nike sent me the wrong freaking shoe. I was disappointed, bro. Highly disappointed. Well, we have about 15 more minutes, chat. You're talking yourself into the into a buy. I know basically, David. I'm basically talking myself to buy the shoe. Should I buy or not? Nah? What's your thoughts on the Air Force One? uh Swar swarovski i'm sorry if i'm saying that wrong um i'm not a big fan of it honestly it's way too much money for me bro just my personal opinion yo hanover fizz my boy hanover fizz for the ten dollar dono what's happening everybody time to kick off the holidays and family time let's end the year strong shout out to my boy my brother from another mother Hand over fist for the $10 donos. Appreciate you, my dog. Shout out to hand over, bro. Appreciate you, bro. Thank you so much for the $10 dono and the positive vibes in the chat, man. As always, man. Appreciate it, bro. Do it. Ravi, you coffin G. I don't know, Dark Super. I'm I'm almost getting convinced. I'm like convincing myself. Maybe I should go for it. That's the addiction of sneakers, bro. Like. The addiction of sneakers is going for a shoe that you possibly don't need in your collection. Like, literally, I even talked about this last week. I don't wear any of my Jordan 1s. Literally. I don't remember the last time I wore a Jordan 1. I really don't. I still got to break out some of the sneakers in my collection. Like, I still need to break out the Starfish Lows. Still need to break out my freaking, um, my Pollens. I haven't worn those yet. It's like, bro, like, oh man. I think I might, I need, I might need to hold off. I might just go for the shoe for the wifey, honestly. I feel like she'll like these, but I feel like she'll like the Amma Maneers a little bit better. I don't know, man. I have too many, I have too many shoes. I really do. And this is, this is a shoe that I feel like I'm going to get convinced to buy. We'll see. I don't know. 
I got two pairs of the uh, Alma Veneers in store raffles, me and my wife entry. There you go. Congratulations, my friend. I'm not sure how much they're going for. Honestly, for the Alma Veneers. Let's see. Jordan won. Because we'll see. Because you guys already know. Sneakers app, they're probably going to only have a couple thousand pairs. Alma um, Veneers. Okay, let's see how much these are going for. Oh, they're going for a good amount of money, man. They're going for like $600, bro. $600. Woo! Yeah, these are going for a lot of money. A lot of money. Ravi, uh, you're starting to talk me out of it. Uh, LMAO might just pass now. Hey, like I said, it's totally up to you, bro. Totally up to you. Don't make my decisions. Don't make my opinions. Well, I mean, depends if uh, unless you don't really want it. Don't make my opinions determine whether if you want a shoe or not. You know what I mean? Like if you want a sneak, if you want the sneaker, go for it. But it's I'm I just know that it's just gonna be one of those sneakers that it's literally gonna sit in the freaking box behind me, and it's got it's not gonna do anything. Literally, there's seventy thousand pairs out there. If anyone was wondering, seventy thousand pairs. Uh, wifey and I are going for the ones for the toe. There you go. Exactly, it's your money and you spend it how you want it. Don't let anyone determine your decisions how you want to spend your money, bruh. All right, are all the draws over uh, the Alma Manier ones? I believe so. I'm not 100% sure. They officially release next week, Wednesday. Um, I know the in store raffles are completely over and a lot of people took W's so. Um, me personally, I'm gonna wait to the Amma Manier website and go from there um, and see how that goes. Uh, listen to your uh, listen to your contemplating uh, between these and the Amma Manier, then go for these in case you don't hit of the Amma Manier. Uh, worst case, uh, return them if you do not hit on the Amma Manier Jordan ones. I mean. I don't think these are going to resell for much. And like I said, chat, this is going to come down to the one of the, like, probably the most underrated Jordan 1 to come out this year, I would say. So, it's crazy because I'm telling you, bro, don't pay stupid resale prices, bro. For real, for real. Like Corvette, Corvette. Like, I am tired of seeing literally resellers talk talk things out of their ass saying like oh my god these are gonna go for like thousands of dollars later like i am sick and tired of it bro like for real for real like i love the resellers out there but the resellers that are out there that get like millions and thousands a hundred of pairs of early pairs of jordans i hate how they literally talk highly about resale prices because they don't know shit about resale prices, in my personal opinion. Any reseller that sells you an early pair of any Jordans, and they say, oh yeah, these are going to be super limited, and these are going to go for $1,000. Bro, next thing you know, you're buying a freaking sneaker for eight, dollars $900 early, and then once release comes, it just freaking tanks. All right? I am so sick and tired of seeing a specific reseller on Instagram, and I just unfollowed them yesterday. Of literally selling early pairs and then they're like don't sleep on this this is this this price is gonna be where it's at look at stock x yeah the stock x numbers are stupid high because it hasn't released bro i was so mad yesterday like people are getting hit in the head for so much money for early pairs of jordans and i've said this before chat that is one thing i will tell you guys not to do is to buy a jordan freaking early because at this point, like, the price is just going to tank, bro. All right? If they want to make their money, hey, make their money. Like I said, that's the, that's the plus about it that I, I respect is making your money. But I'm telling you guys to be financially smart, not to buy an early pair of these Jordans. Like, even a general release early, early, bro. All right? It just sucks. Because the thing is, people are tired of, like, waiting around you know for sneakers app and waiting for the l so people are willing to pay pay the price you know what i mean and, and you're right it's the buyer's fault it's not the seller's fault because you like i said 
they have they just got good customer service bruh they really got good customer service and that 100 <laughs> percent head over it's exactly like a carnival worker bro you're gonna you're guaranteed you're guaranteed to win a prize you want the biggest prize on the freaking wall hey all you gotta do is pay 50 bucks <laughs> for three shots you know what i mean um but like i said you, you could do whatever you want with your money at the end of the day bruh for real for real uh it's just it's crazy it's crazy the same amount of people that you know buy a crazy amount of money for an early pair of sneakers which is fine bro like i said you can do whatever you want with your money shout out to jerry for the two dollar donation like and subscribe good luck um collection fam for a w and like i said it's not the amount of people that are buying the shoe early it's that the resellers think they're so educated when it comes to the resale market that's what i'm getting at i'm what i'm getting at is that they act like they know the market but they don't know the market if that makes sense but like i said it's just all advertising so people could buy the sneaker early and they make their money which is fine but it's just i just don't like how re some resellers act like they know the market like we know that a lot of these general releases are gonna tank bro like come on like it's just it's just guaranteed mostly for a general release shoe you know what i mean so uh i don't 100 agree i've seen too many shoes tank then go well okay i understand that so shoes some of the sneakers will definitely tank and then go back up right but i'm saying for early pairs that haven't really don't release in like a month or two like they're taxing like nine eight hundred dollars i remember when resellers were taxing unc fours and unc ones for nine hundred dollars nine hundred dollars people were paying nine hundred dollars for unc fours and unc ones and hyper royals because they were like look at the market look at stock x it's crazy bro that that's what i'm getting at like i said i'm not hating on the hustle i'm hating on the on the uh what's it called the education part of the market if that makes sense so i can see this definitely going up all right that's what i'm saying this is definitely going to be one of the sleepers uh jordan one sleepers of the year i would say so yeah five more minutes chat five more minutes these are definitely sleepers, 100%. These Jordan 1s right here, sleepers. Definitely sleepers. Uh, Rafi got my Halloween Air Force 1s in yesterday. So much better than uh, the e experimental uh, Air Force 1s. I mean, you might you might as well like stock them up till next year Halloween. <laughs> unless you want to wear them. Um, Sam, it's not hustling for the $20. $20 is $20, bro. All right? You're gonna see. A, I feel like you're gonna see a lot of resellers buying this shoe right here, because I feel like this was this will definitely go up in price, in my personal opinion. Uh, people said the pollens were gonna go up as well. It's gonna take some time, though. You know, it's definitely gonna take some time, though. It's definitely going to take some time. I feel like Jordan ones always hold its value. You know what I mean? Jordan ones always hold its value, but I feel like Jordan brand will not stop making Jordan ones. Like you're gonna see Jordan ones every single year, because that's literally their that's literally their bread and butter. That's their bread and butter is Jordan ones. Like they they could easily sell Jordan ones easily. You know what I mean? So, but good luck to everybody this morning. I think I think this is definitely gonna be a pass for me. I don't think I'm gonna go for a pair this morning. I'm here for your guys' support. Right? Stock numbers is about seventy one thousand pairs. I uh, appreciate you guys kind of like hearing me out about that, you know, really not a rant. I would just say, just say just a conversation. We're just having a conversation, right? Um, but everyone has their own opinions about it. I, I don't, I don't, I, I, the thing is like, I don't want to, I don't want to make you guys feel like I'm knocking anyone's hustle. Like, Hey, make your bread, bro. For real, for real. Like people offer me, you know, shoes all the time on DMS for retail. For a shoe that goes for like four hundred dollars like i'd be like yo bro no i don't need it make your bread he was like yo bro i just wanted to reach out 
you know i you know i get a, i get some dms like that and like i really do appreciate you guys looking out for me but i want you guys to make your bread if i know a shoe is gonna is going for a lot of money and you're offering me like like almost dead ass retail for the sneaker i'll say no i was like bro no they'll literally hit you guys some of you guys will hit me up be like yo raffi before i go and sell this i want to offer you a really good price on this i'll be like yo bro i don't need it go make your bread i really don't want that price like literally i would love that price but i don't need the shoe but i'd rather have you make your money all right that's what i'm trying to get at like i'm not trying to knock anyone's hustle at all it's just the education part of the market that i'm i'm hating on all right um i always make money because i know how to hold never uh never thirsty to make 200 or 200 bucks uh 200 bucks i hold long time yeah like, like i said man some shoes are a good is a good hold all right some like some people have their their different styles of reselling there's short term and there's long term you know what i mean long terms are the ones that literally will hold a bunch of sneakers for like six plus months maybe over a year and see how the market goes with it if it doesn't do anything within a year they literally move it there's some people like majority of us that does quick flips meaning like if you want to make like 60 70 80 dollars real quick then sell the shoe you know what i mean so there's 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 uh there's a lot of style of reselling it's not including when it's sneakers you know what i mean that's how it, the market is in general like if you do stocks there's people that do long-term holds there's some people do like uh you know uh short-term short short-term hold and you know make their profit and then run with it so um i love how people are hating on these but uh those strawberry coughs it's like uh these are at least a wearable with a multi-color fit multiple multiple fits yeah I, I would definitely say and i've said that before it's like this shoe is definitely wearable right um he's stalling out what do you mean we got one more minute we got one more minute plus it's a 10 minute draw you a goofy boy for saying that it's a 10 minute draw so we got five seconds good luck to everybody that's trying to cop this morning once again good luck i'm passing on this release this morning all right good luck everybody bro for real for a corvette corvette good luck um why make money if you can lose it <laughs> good luck everybody that's joining the draw good luck everybody make sure you guys run it up hit that like button for some good luck if you guys are gonna hit or if you guys are going for these this morning good luck you boys i'm gonna pass on this this morning chat i'm passing on this this morning um morning ravi just waking up uh may have to pass on these yeah i'm passing on these this morning yeah good luck to everybody yeah 100 percent. good luck to everybody it's join draw but there's no timer why is this not let me refresh this real quick there it is there's the timer there's that timer uh resale is looking like 200 220 i feel like bigger sizes is gonna do justice when it comes to like um when it comes to like long like long-term holds i feel like the the bigger sizes is gonna hold up value so i got a pass too uh join last minute and let's see if you uh could cop no nah, man i'm not gonna do that i'm not gonna do that i'm i'm just gonna pass on it today I'm just going to pass it on this morning. Let me see this real quick. Manganda Umaga, uh, brother. What up, Victor? Good morning to you. I have a Maroon 6s and PSG 4s. Don't think I need anyone, any Bordeaux colorway. I don't have any Bordeaux colorway. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I have no Bordeaux colorways in my sneaker collection. Um, The closest that I have in like a Bordeaux color... Yeah, I don't have any Bordeaux color, actually. I have none. I have no Bordeaux colorway. Um, uh, let's see. If it ain't uh, Bordeaux 7s, it ain't it. <laughs> I mean, like I said, man, it's not a bad sneaker overall. It's not a bad shoe. Jordan 1 highs. I'm actually curious how the quality is going to look like on these ones. Um, Because the Midnight Navy Blues was a 
was a pretty it was pretty good leather on it but i'm actually curious how the leather is going to look like on these i mean we can lo actually look at the uh the pictures there's some sort of tumble on the toe box some sort of tumble and even on the side of the sneaker just the homie oliver rodriguez for the five dollar donation morning wrap and collection fam went for uh Went for Christmas uh, gift sizes, uh, but got a W on this live stream. Y'all know the vibe. Smash that like button and subscribe. Shout out to my boy, the family, Oliver Rodriguez for the $5 donation. I appreciate it, my friend. Appreciate it, bro. I miss you already, Oliver. I miss you already. We got it, bro. We got to go back. We got to meet up again. Me, you, and JMK. And all the other homies and go get some Korean barbecue again, man. That was fun. Good vibes for sure. That's the homie Oliver. Uh, smooth, tumbled. Material is like the pollens. Okay. So it's pretty good quality. I mean, it sounds like from what you guys are saying, it's pretty good quality. Um, yeah, once, uh, once the, once the raffle ends, we'll have a pull. We'll have a pull. You papi muñeño. How long do you think uh, the app will be go pending? Well, this one is a raffle, so I don't think it's going to be, it's going to take too long. It's not going to take too long, honestly. It's not going to take too long. It's the Leo drops that took forever yesterday. Like, that Leo drop yesterday for the freaking Jordan 1 low mochas. I don't know why it took super long. Winterized Jordan 14s on the JD Sports app. Yeah, I'm not a. I don't, I'm gonna skip on the 14s. Shout out to Brit Not Spears. Winterized Jordan 14s on JD Sports. Are these resellable? I mean, you're gonna make like 30. You're gonna make like 40 dollars maybe, because retail is 170, 180. So it's gonna be like 20, 40. You you gonna you can make like 40 dollars, man. 40, 50 dollars, honestly. And 40, 50 dollars adds up, man. The amount of if depending on the amount of pairs that you you get, like it adds up pretty quickly uh how about the alma manier jordan ones yeah they're gonna go for a lot of money i mean it's gonna it's gonna go down a bit but i feel like jordan ones hold its hold it holds its value i think it's gonna hold its value more than jordan three but you got to think about the alma manier is a woman's shoe so remember that you got to go for a woman you got to go for a men's size you got to uh convert your men's to a woman's that's that might be a lot of people's mistakes is that they won't convert their men's size to women's so are these a hold i think this is going to be a really long-term hold in my personal opinions for these ones a long-term hold for these bad boys but i'm gonna skip on these joints this morning i'm not i'm not going for it uh ravi when a drop is happening and i'm in school i listen to the streams and make my day love your dude hey i appreciate that um camden is that your name appreciate you bro appreciate your support but make sure you uh make sure hopefully you have good grades at school man i want to get everyone make sure you stay in school um uh yeezy hoodie finally shipped raffi there you go mj there you go bro alma manier is woman sizing yeah it's a woman's shoe man i believe it's a woman's shoe for alma manier's i believe so let me see alma manier jordan ones i thought it was a woman's shoe is it not I guess it's just men's. I thought this would be woman sizing, right? Is Alma Manier women's or is it? But not the ones. Okay, only okay. The threes were a woman's, not the ones. Okay, that's probably why it's going for a lot. So Alma Manier's is men's sizing. Okay, my bad, chat. My bad. Alma Manier Jordan ones is men's, not women's. My bad. I thought it was women's. I thought it was woman sizing. My bad. Um. Yeah, I know. Sorry, I, that was my mistake. I thought the Alma Manier ones are women's, but it's men's. The Alma Manier Jordan ones are men's sizing. My bad. That was my mistake. I thought they were women's. They're men's. Um, I'm not copying, but hopefully getting a pair for the wife. Hey, good luck. Manifest that W. We got three more minutes. Three more minutes. Yeah, it's men's sizing. My bad. That was my mistake, chat. My bad. That was my bad. Uh, I almost bought a pair for uh, three hundred dollars yesterday. What sneaker? You talking about these ones right here? You had me scared. I won the wrong size. No, my bad, Brit Not Spears. My bad. That was my bad. It's men's. It's uh, all. It's all men's sizing. 
Uh, Raffi, I enjoy watching your streams over Roscoe. Roscoe's cool too, and like I said, Chad, you could, you you gotta watch both of us. You know what I mean? You gotta you gotta support. Like literally, me and Roscoe are literally the only consistent like streamers on YouTube. I mean, there's a couple other people, but I mean, like we consistently like live cop every single shoe. I would say. I mean, that we I could think of like. I don't know i mean there's trevor there's what mojo mojo kicks the little homie world mojo kicks i can't even enter the draw it says uh it says air every time good luck everybody big facts good luck everybody i know you guys are literally imagine if i literally sign up literally last minute literally if i sign up last minute go for it nah what if i sign up like 10 seconds left <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, that'd be bad. That'd honestly be bad. Honestly, really, really bad if I did that. Consistent US law uh, streamers. Yeah, literally, I stream almost every single day and I have a full time job. Like, literally, I literally stream every single day. Uh, Y'all smash that like button for the for good luck. Facts. No, we're still going to pass on it. Resale value. There's not much. There's not much resale value to it. Make sure you guys run it up though. We got one more minute. Do it. No, you guys don't convince me. You guys are bad influences. <laughs> a lot of you in here are bad influence, man. He said, do it. <laughs> Join. These are bad influence. You know what I was doing yesterday? Looking at new houses. Okay? So you guys are not gonna fool me. Alright? <laughs> I'm not doing it. I'm not convinced. I'm not convinced. I'm absolutely not convinced. You guys are not gonna do me like that. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are bad influences. I'm not doing it. I'm absolutely not gonna do it. Y'all are bad influences. Yo, y'all are bad influences, bro. Chill, 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 chill. chill. I ain't doing it, chat. Y'all ain't gonna, y'all ain't gonna convince me. Y'all tweaking. <laughs> Yo, chill. Um. Seven seconds, five, four, three, two, one. Y'all, y'all, draw close, too late. <laughs> oh, you guys almost got me. You guys were, I was literally this close, like this dead ass close. I was this close. I was this close doing it, bro. I was this close to doing it, like dead ass. Like, you guys almost got me convinced. Like, this close. Like, you guys are so bad, bro. Oh my gosh, y'all are, no, y'all, y'all, I was so close. I was that close. Uh, can I get the Discord link, Raffi? I'll, I shared it in the end of the stream, man. I'll share it at the end of the stream. All right, let me know if you guys hit. I'm going to put a poll out real quick. Let me put a poll. Let me see. I'm going to say who copped. W or an L. Let me know if you guys cop. Let me know if you guys cop W or an L. Let me know. All right. You got a W, Jake. There you go. That was a quick. That was a quick one. Make sure you guys answer the poll. Let me know. You're gonna uh, regret not copping. Nah, I'll be fine, man. I'll be fine. I already got new pairs of shoes in. I got the off white twos in. I got the off white twos in. We're good. We're good. Should have added a pass on the option. It's all good. It doesn't show. W's, congratulations. Make sure you guys run it up though. Hold on, let me see. If you guys are new here, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. I appreciate you guys. Good luck if you guys are hidden. We're trying to hit W's, got them's. Passed. W's, there you go, Alex. Congratulations. Yeah, next week should be a really great week, man. Next week should be solid. Should be solid. Got him's. Got him's Brenda. She said she's got him's. Congratulations. Make sure you guys post him on Discord, all right? Post him on the W's Discord, man. I want to see them all. I want to see all the W's. But congratulations to whoever hit. Got him in a four and a half. 
What's next week? Next week's Alma Meniers. Alma Meniers Jordan 1s. We have a bunch of dunks releasing. We have the Potas next week as well. So, yeah, let me know if you guys hit. I'm here for moral support. Shout out to Bam Bam. Appreciate you, my friend. Um, Grand Rising Raffi from the VA. Thank you for uh, for having the best live show on YouTube. I appreciate it, bro. Appreciate the support, man. Man, like I said, I I'm just here. I'm just here to help you guys out, bro. For real, for real. Corvette, Corvette. Make sure you guys run it up. Shout out to the Discord group. All right, and shout out to everyone for supporting the channel, man. We hit twenty one thousand subscribers, so. I appreciate you guys. If you guys are new here, make sure you guys remember to hit that subscribe button. Um, Alma Muneer is dropping on their website next week, Wednesday. They're dropping on the website next week. Uh, my wife uh, took a W for me. There you go. Congratulations to the wifey for coming in clutch. Congratulations. There you go. W, I'm still pinning on a size 11 half and a 7. Yeah, stay patient. Once again, there's 70,000 pairs out there, man. There's a lot of pairs out there. But once again, good luck to everybody. Have you seen 50-50 on a poll before? Yeah, I have. Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram. Let me know if you guys took that W. Appreciate you guys. Shout out to Thomas. Thank you so much for subbing. Mondrezy. Thank you so much for subscribing. Uh, Kiddo, Thank you so much for subscribing. Appreciate you uh, supporting the channel. Thank you so much. Uh, let's see. Hold on. Let me see this real quick. I'm canceling them. LOL. I took an L. I'm still waiting. Still waiting. Still waiting. Got him at 11 and a half. Congratulations. So people are still waiting. It looks like. Did you go for them? No, I passed on it this morning. I passed on the release this morning. I didn't go for them. You guys almost convinced me though. You literally, you, all of you guys literally almost convinced me to go for it. Like, honestly, you guys are literally bad influences. Ravi, my fiance, hit again. Lord, have uh, we started. There you go, Rahus. Let her have her moment, Rahus. Let her have her moment. But let's celebrate, chat. Y'all want to celebrate? Let's celebrate, bro. Let's celebrate. Who, who's ready to celebrate your guys' Ws? I'll celebrate for you guys. To the ones that hit this morning, whether if you passed on it, whether if you guys hit on it, whether if you guys took an L on it, we are celebrating this morning and let's turn the hell up, chat. All right, let's wake up, start the weekend off with the bang, man. Here we go. Time to get out of bed. Time to wake up Time to get out of bed oh. you guys coming through i'm gonna get out of here chat you guys enjoy the rest of your weekend congratulations to all the w's and i'm gonna get out of here chat i'm gonna start my weekend off with a bang all right i'm out of here enjoy the rest of y'all weekend i'll see you guys next week bro i'll see you guys next week all right Salute to you guys. Make sure you guys hit that like button. You got a dope ass hit that subscribe mentality. button if you guys are new here. Greatly appreciate all the love and support, guys. All right. Got em's, got em's, got em's, got em's, man. If you guys hit, let me know on Instagram. Follow me on Instagram at RapidCollects. All right. Let me know. But I'm out of here, man. Peace. <laughs>